question. What is it about Andover that makes it so special? Well, it's the community. We got a great sense of community in Andover. Look at all the people that are out here for our Andover days. 120 booths today at Andover days. And we've got a great state rep. No, it's a wonderful community because of people, you know, like like Barbara and like Tom and the folks that yeah. uh, live here. They, they want to be here. Great schools, great location. And when we have a, a Andover days like this, why not be in Andover? Right. Where else would you want to be? Close to Boston. Lots of fun. Family town. This is so. Barbara Latalia, and Barbara is our state Hi. representative How are you? running. Hi. And uh, quick question: What is it about Andover that makes it so special? Oh, it's such a great town. I've lived here since I was six years old, and um, it has a wonderful town feel that other communities don't. You know, things like this, where everyone can come and get together and see each other. Not many towns do this anymore, so it, that's really what I think makes Andover great. And a place where the town manager can give his favorite <laughs> rep a kiss. There you <laughs> go. All right. oh, thank you. This is Bob Lavoy. He's a, a local real estate and development, real estate development attorney. And just had a quick question. I mean, what is it about Andover? I know you're from Amesbury originally, but what is it that makes Andover special? I think it's the people. Yeah. The spirit of volunteerism. Yeah. Everybody contributes. Yeah. Everybody donates their time. Yeah. And when you have an event like this where you have 120 booths in this volume of people, it really does say something special about this house. It's one of my best events of the year. This is Peter Caruso, another local real estate attorney. What makes Andover so special? You've lived on Salem Street for how many years? It's all oh, 39 years. And why why have you been in Andover for 39 years? It's What's a unique it? diversity of people and businesses. It keeps us alive, excited, and vibrant. And of course, the lawyers in town are the best. <laughs> Did I say something wrong? We have a good, very good crop of real estate lawyers. Starting with Divine Melamed, right here. Uh, Peter Caruso is the exact name. <laughs> Peter Caruso, Divine Melamed. Thanks, Peter. What is it that brought you to Andover? Uh, the people. Part of it, you know, it's definitely the people. My wife's family's from here, so my in-laws are from the area. And it's just a great community, I think, you know? It's a, yeah. Happy to be, happy to be around. Yeah, when you see an event like this, it just kind of sends that message, you know? Yeah. And the school system, too, you know, being a, a young father, you know, we know that the schools are really good. My, my older daughter just started kindergarten, and uh, so that was another draw. What makes Andover special? How did you, why did you settle here? schools. Okay. But before knowing anything else, I, I heard that I had a good school system and I was right. Yeah. We picked it before we had kids. That's why we moved here, so I mean it doesn't surprise me. And that's probably the driving force for at least half the people that move here. Yeah, I mean once you get here you realize that real estate values don't don't move. I mean they they go up if anything. What makes Andover so special? I think the sense of community and, and um, a lot of us, you included, have been been here for years and we look out after each other. A lot of community events by it, like Andover Skate Park. What is it about Andover that made you decide to settle here? It's just a terrific community, absolutely terrific. The schools are great, the people are wonderful, and my kids are uh, you know, growing up in a, in a great community. That's why we decided to settle here. Uh, Andover is if you want to raise a family and you want to have uh, you know, a nice environment for your children to, to grow up in. And uh, he's a, a home builder and remodeler here in the area. He's also chairman of the Republican Committee in town. And you chose to move to Andover to raise your family. What was it about Andover that kind of... Well, I grew up in Reading, and uh, that's a great community. But when I looked at Andover, I thought they had a great tax base. And uh, overall, they had a tremendously balanced community and a great school system. So uh, I decided to move into Andover because of all, all that, and I think it's, uh, although we have our challenges, it's an yeah. extremely well-run town. You know, I love Andover. I've lived here for 18 years, and first, it has a great school system, and uh, my son, who's now a senior in college, uh, got the best education, loves it. And then the other thing about Andover, it's, it's convenient to everything. You're 20 minutes from different malls, you're a half hour away from Boston, and there's just so much to love about Andover. This is Barry Feingold. He's running for our state senator. He's been a state rep for 14 years. Before that, he was a selectman in Andover. Raised it. Yeah, raised it. I haven't done fire much. Still the same time I grew up in. <laughs> Went to Andover High School. That's right. What is it about Andover that you decided to raise your family here? This is his great, wife, Amy. Good job. Thank you. <laughs> great community, great schools, uh, great, great family place, and just a wonderful community that cares about one another.